Hey guys, what's going on? Today I will be showcasing the plugin titled Chat Color by MC Sulfate. This plugin allows you to take full control of your server's chat features with support for more than 16 million different colors, the Minecraft modifiers, and more. This plugin is fully customizable. So the base command for this plugin is going to be slash chat color or slash chat color help. Just doing chat color actually gives you a preview of what your chat will look like with the color and the modifiers active. So we actually have a special hex color with bold. So we say, hey, this is Eric. As you guys can see, it matches pretty much exactly with the preview. Now if we're to do slash chat color help, we get all of the commands related to the plugin along with various useful modifiers and colors. So we can go ahead and set a color for ourselves. We could do chat color and then this nice text code that I found online along with a modifier like O for italics. So then we can say hello, this is Eric. Now we can also set the chat color for other users if you are, you know, a staff rank on your server. You can go do slash chat color, the name of the user you want to change the color for, followed by the color. So we can go ahead and set it to something like 9, and then modifiers, maybe the strike through. And as you guys can see, we got Darrow's color modified, and as soon as he typed, it became active. Now we also got stuff like available colors, so if you do slash chat color available, pretty much what that does just lets you know what colors you have access to. And as you guys can see, it's pretty similar to the last list earlier, and it also lets us know we have access to hex codes. This is entirely based upon which permissions you give to your users. The plugin is pretty precise about the permissions corresponding with different colors, so that is definitely nice to see as well. Another thing that I like is the GUI menu. This allows you to select colors very easily, and they are mostly the primary colors, but there's also a customizable rainbow that you can select as well. So we can go ahead and set our chat color to bold and rainbow. And as you guys can see, we can also add in the underline. And here's what we have right now. We set our color to this and we could go ahead and say hello. And we can actually go ahead and set the rainbow ourselves. All right, so I found some hex codes that I think would work pretty nicely with um, the rainbow sequence. So we can go do chat color set and then rainbow dash sequence. And then we can go ahead and enter this in. And as you guys can see, these are all the colors that we have uh, selected. So we could go ahead and do chat color confirm. And now the rainbow sequence has been set to the following colors. And we can go ahead and do chat color rainbow or we could access it from the GUI menu as always. So then we could say something like, hey guys, I am now talking in rainbow. And as you guys can see, um, if you add too many colors, maybe it can be a little bit distracting for some people. I completely uh, get that for sure. But you know, I think it's a really nice feature as well. Um, especially if you get like some nice pastel colors going, it can actually look quite pleasing to the eye. And what I just edited here is actually in the settings help. This is actually like editing parts of the config just within the game. So you could control stuff like auto saving data, color override, um, default color, join message, notifying others, uh, the rainbow sequence that we just saw, and forcing custom colors. So there's quite a bit that you can edit here. Additionally, other commands that we have here you know we just saw the settings help but there's also the reload which just reloads the config and the plugin you can also set specific settings and you can go ahead and set players chat color to default so if we got tired of you know seeing the rainbow we could just set it to default and there's no modifiers no color whatsoever just the classic minecraft white 
So guys, I think that just about does it for the chat color plugin. There's quite a lot in here, but overall, the plugin is very streamlined and easy for any player to access and get into it. So without further ado, I'll leave a link to download this plugin down in the description below. I'll also leave a link and IP address to my Minecraft server Barbercraft down in the description below as well. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys later. Peace.